What's up, you guys? My name is Mary. I'm with High Priestess Intuition. Welcome, my current subscribers, and welcome, 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 newbies. If you guys are new to my channel and you enjoy my content, you can smash the sub button to be notified for future readings. Just saying. This is a collective reading, Capsule Sagittarius, and everybody in between. Don't forget the basics. Time is fluid. Energy is fluid. If it doesn't apply, let it fly. Everyone has free will. Only take the messages that resonate. Um, thanks, everybody, for all the love and support to the channel. Um, I appreciate all the love and support. I truly do from the bottom of my heart chakra. Um, if you'd like to donate, it's High Priestess to Five. The link's in the description box below. PayPal only, no cash app, no Venmo. Single mom and two kids, so it truly helps. I appreciate everything. I truly do from the bottom of my heart chakra. Um, I've gotten several decks from you guys. I've gotten donations. Um, I've gotten letters in the mail, thank you cards. Um, you guys are just the best. You really, really are. Um, I truly love my soul trap. I do. And you guys have been rocking with me. Some of you guys have been rocking me since March of 2020, um, which is about a year and a half ago. So um, I love you guys. I really, really do. Okay. So um, it's 5.12 a.m. on January 2nd, 2022. Um, the channel message I received, it was right before I clicked the camera on, was, um, uh, okay. So Here's what I heard. Um, <clears throat> someone that said that a Leo feminine was dead in the past. It's about to, karma is about to cycle around for them in a very huge negative way. Um, because someone is getting a huge wake up call that they are obviously not dead. They are living a very, um, very, um, very full life is what I heard. And then it was like two or three minutes after that. I heard um, someone that you thought was dead is about to resurface. Um, Taurus masculine is what I heard. So you plug it in how it resonates. We've got one person, um, somebody said that somebody was dead, Leo Femme. Now they could have Leo in their sun, moon, rising, Venus, Warp, and Midheim, or Jupiter. You could have been the one that said the Leo Femme had passed away and said she had died or... Um, you could be the Leo Femme that somebody said died. How would that resonate? Same for the Taurus masculine, because the Leo Femme, somebody was spreading around, um, it sounds like spreading around she had died, um, but she had not. The ones that gossiped and said that she had passed away knew she had not, and it's about to come around and bite them in the ass in a huge way. Some, they did it to steal her inheritance. Some, they did it to try to take her home. Some, they did it to try to get her pregnant and keep her captive. But it's about to backfire in a huge way. Oh, my God. Whoa. What the hell, man? Woo-hoo. Woo-hoo. Okay, so you plug it in how it resonates. That's crazy. Okay, so we open energy strong. We've got two people we're pulling in here. Leo feminine energy. They could have Leo in their fem energy, vaginal part, B or P, just B and P, B slash P, just saying. They could have Leo in their sun, moon, rising, Venus, ortho, midheim, or Jupiter, Taurus, masculine. Those two people we're pulling in so far. We're going to do the Leo fem so far because I'm getting a lot of channel on her. So the Leo fem, I heard some, so the people that basically spread it around and gossip that she was dead, that she had passed away in the past. Um, some people did it for whoever gossiped and said that she had passed away in the past. They did it for strategic reasons. But it sounds like the ones that did it for strategic reasons did it for different strategic reasons is what it sounds like to me from the messages. They could have done it for one strategic reason or two plus because there's three in there. So some of them, they um, did it to um, take her inheritance, I heard. So steal money from her. Some, they did it to um, get, I heard, get her pregnant and secretly hold her captive. What the fuck, man? That's like Creeper, um, Char what, what's his name? Um, Hannibal Lecter style shit. Just saying, just saying. Except, well, not quite Hannibal Lecter. He wasn't into knocking people up, but he sure was into holding people captive, captive and um, weird dark holes and eating Eating, eating folks, just saying. Um, but how that resonates? So, hold her captive, get her pregnant, hold her captive, basically. Take her money. 
And the other one was, um, what was the other one? There was another one. There was another one. You'll have to go back and check it. There was a third one, a third reason why they wanted to say she had passed away. But all those reasons are negative reasons. They're negative, negative reasons um, that wish her ill, that wish her ill, period. Um, there was no positive out of that, no love out of that. Um, it was all strictly to take, 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 take basically. But I heard this basically about to backfire on them in a huge way. Um, in a huge way. Okay, I heard it in a huge way. And we have protection on the bottom of the deck. I have not shuffled out yet. Um, not yet. But this is what we got on the bottom of the deck. And to me, that goes perfectly with this because I feel um, now we're pulling in two people. I'm channeling her in real strong right now. Um, but I feel both of these people might be protected. Um, because we have protection on the bottom of the deck. Let's see if we hear anything. Both of these people are very spiritually protected. One is being very heavily protected by law enforcement right now. And the other one is about to contact law enforcement. Taurus Energy. Well, damn, you, you, you plug it in how it resonates. Okay. Wow. This is, this is something, this is something, something, something. So we've got two Leo fam, Taurus masculine. I heard, um, they're both spiritually protected. So both of these people are spiritually protected. Leo fam, Taurus masculine, both spiritually protected. And, um, I heard the Leo fam is being pl uh, protected by police right now. So police are, um, I think secretly watching to make sure nothing happens to her because I think maybe she was harassed and bullied and um I think they knew she was harassed and bullied or maybe she filed a police report that she was harassed or bullied or maybe she put a protection order in or a restraining order in against person people place or situation which is causing maybe heightened intuition in the police force to cause some kind of protection energy however that resonates but um Protection, I heard police protection for her. Now, I feel it is, um, I don't feel they're out sitting out with a marked vehicle outside her home. Is I mean, I think it's very undercover, very secret, very behind the scenes is what I'm feeling. But you have to plug it in how it resonates. Um, because, you know, if they have a marked officer out there <laughs> at somebody's home and residence 24-7, that's just weird and um alarms neighborhoods so um obviously it's not going to be like that is what i'm trying to say so um which would be the smart thing so um put protection in this realm it is spiritual protection for both of these people police protection for her and i heard the taurus masculine the one that i guess a lot of people thought they um he was dead um is about to come back to not back to life but about to make his presence known that he's not dead um however that resonates i don't know if he said he was dead or people said he was dead or however that resonates but people thought he was dead people thought he was dead but they're about to realize he's not dead um and he's about to call the police he is so he's about to call the police for protection now why were he's about to call the police that might be for protection for him. It might be to give information to protect him. It might, I mean, because it sounds like, it sounds like he's highly intuitive. It sounds like, um, I think they both have abilities is what I think. I think, I heard they're both spiritually protected. I think they both have abilities and absolutely do. I think this person is highly freaking intuitive. I think they both are, but I think he's highly freaking intuitive and he knows it's a smart thing to do. He absolutely knows it's a smart thing to do given the past. He's about to make some huge power play moves. Okay, so you plug it in how it resonates. Okay, so I heard he absolutely knows it's a smart thing to do given the past and he's about to make some power play moves. So Taurus Masculine, so now we're pulling him in very strong. So... He's spiritually protected, and he, I heard he's about to call the police because he knows this is a smart thing to do um, now. 
given the past. So something crazy has happened in the past regarding him and the Leo Femme or something happened to him in the Leo Femme. It sounds like they're two completely different energies and two completely different time planes and realms and energetic spaces is what it sounds like here. Two different um, astral planes. Now they might go up and astral project together in the 5D, but 3D wise, they are definitely, it sounds like they live completely separate lives, completely different um, spaces, et cetera, et cetera. But somehow they are connected. I think they're interconnected possibly in the 5D, possibly. Um, but you plug it in how it resonates. But I heard he knows it's a smart thing to do. He knows it's a smart thing to do. Uh, for some of these Taurus masculines, they might have pretended they were dead um, in some weird, shifty ass crazy ass plan in the past. And now they know it's smart to come clean and, hey, I'm alive, I'm alive, you know, um, possibly. I mean, I don't know. I don't know. You have to plug it in how it resonates. Everybody's story different. Only you know your story, not anybody else. And you have to plug yourself in where you fit if you do. You could be the Leo Femme. You could be the Taurus Masculine. You could be somebody connected to these people. You have to plug yourself in where you fit if you do. But lots of protection energy here, spiritual, police, and um, maybe otherwise. Let's see if we hear anything else. One of these Tauruses is a police officer. Not not claim they were dead but they are about to reveal some very important information to someone they work with high up okay whoa okay so we got three people in here now so we got leo fem taurus masculine and another taurus masculine but this person is a police officer i heard um so they're actually a police officer so we've got, it sounds like this person is not a police officer. This person, I don't feel is because they're being protected by the police. This person is. So two Taurus masculine energies, one Leo femme energy. And the Taurus, ma the police officer Taurus masculine, I heard basically is about to reveal some very important information to um, somebody high up in their police force, law enforcement sector, law enforcement community, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. It's about to blow the lid on a Leo feminine and a Sagittarius feminine and a Scorpio masculine and a Pisces femme. Okay, whoa. Okay, I heard the information, I guess, is Taurus masculine police officer. So you can be the Taurus masculine police officer or somebody connected to this person, um, however it resonates. I heard um, he's a going to blow the, um, blow the lid on some information regarding a Sag, um, a Sag, a Sag, I think I just heard Sag, it could have been masculine or feminine. You have to go back and check. Sag energy, Scorpio masculine, Libra femme, and there was another one. Pisces femme and Pisces femme. So you plug it in how it resonates. And a Capricorn, and a Capricorn, and a Capricorn, okay. Um, and a Gemini, and a Gemini, dear God, and a Gemini, okay. So, um, this person knows some very important information, this police officer. Maybe they were afraid. Maybe you were afraid in the past, police officer, um, Taurus masculine, possibly. You could have Taurus in your sun, moon, rising, Venus, or and Ben Haber, Jupiter, police officer, Taurus masculine, if this resonates with you. Um, but it sounds like you were afraid in the past or you didn't think it was smart in the past. But it sounds like now you're about to protect yourself. You're about to protect the situation. It sounds like it was a very, it sounds like it's either upcoming serious ass situation or it's about to come. Um, however that resonates in your life, but you know it's smart to reveal it. I heard Pisces femme, Libra femme, um, Scorpio masculine, Sag, and there was another. Capricorn, Capricorn. So you plug it in how it resonates. So you're going to protect yourself force masculine if this resonates for you oh and gemini and gemini and gemini gemini masculine gemini masculine so um you're gonna reveal this information on these people um taurus masculine gemini masculine pisces family Libra, fam capricorn sag and scorpio masculine yeah 
Um, sounds a little secret 70 if you ask me, but everybody's situation different, so you have to plug it in how it resonates. Just saying, just saying. Because a lot of those signs were secret seven. Um, but it may, may not be. You plug it in how it resonates. You only, you know your story towards masculine, not anybody else. So protection. You're about to protect yourself by covering your ass. And it sounds like whatever the hell it is, it needs to be revealed. Um, the information needs to be revealed to kind of cover your ass and wipe your hands of it. Police officer. And the same thing goes for the Taurus, other Taurus. Um, somehow somebody either said he died, tried to kill him, or um, or he claimed he died. However, that resonates for this Taurus masculine that's not a police officer. Um, I don't feel he's not a police officer. I didn't hear he was or he wasn't, but I don't feel he is a police officer. Because I heard specifically this person is. So you plug it in how it resonates. Um, that's wow. Someone once told this Taurus masculine that a Leo feminine tried to kill him, but it's very opposite. Very, very, very opposite. He knows now who tried to kill him, and it wasn't her. Family member energy. Oh my, what the hell? Oh my God. You plug it in, how it resonates, you guys. What the crap, man? Okay, so I'm feeling it's this person, because I didn't hear police officer Taurus. I just heard Taurus that apparently people thought he passed away or he faked his own death or whatever the hell it was. Um, He thought the Leo film, I'm assuming it's this person, tried to kill him. Um, But I heard he knows now that's not the case. He knows now it's not the case. It actually was a family member of the Leo film, and he knows who it was. So that might be what he's contacting the police about, possibly. Um, That's what I'm feeling, to get protection for himself. Because I heard he once thought it was a Leo Femme that tried to kill him. And maybe that's why he faked his death or somebody helped him fake his death. How that resonates or or whatever, what have you. But he knows now it wasn't the Leo Femme that tried to kill him. It was somebody else. And it's a family member of um, her. Of her. Um, I heard he knows who it is. So I think he's about to go get protection to, um, from the police to protect himself from the family member or family members that try to kill his ass. That wasn't the Leo fan, but it was a family member of her or family members of her. Um, so you plug it in how it resonates. Oh my God. Let me see if I hear anything else. Wisdom. Knowledge on who really tried to kill him. Taurus dude. You really know now who really tried to kill you, apparently. And it wasn't the Leo Femme. It was a family member of family members of her. But you know who it is now. You've got the knowledge. You've got the wisdom. And maybe, and the thing is, is with this Taurus masculine police officer, this other person in slash energy over here, you have the wisdom and knowledge of this very important ass situation with all these folks up in here. Uh, there's like six or seven, at least six or seven people. It might be more for some of you guys that you're about to reveal. To, and you are the police, and you're about to reveal it to somebody really, really high, I think, that can get the ball rolling on some crap. So wisdom, knowledge, boom, just saying, just saying, whoever you are. Wisdom on the bottom of the deck again. Knowledge, wisdom. Spirit messages you have protected. The Taurus masculine, not the police officer. It's seriously about contemplating donating to someone soon. Possibly a message. They know this person is very, very strong. They have proven it in the past. But they want to show their gratitude now. Now that the lies are being exposed. Okay, so you plug it in how it resonates. Wow. 
well, you go with your bad self Taurus masculine that's not a police officer. Um, this person up here, whoever you are. Um, I heard you um, want to, um, you want to send a donation uh, to someone. We have beginnings and extremes. You want to send a donation to someone? Um, I heard a large donation um, to show your gratitude and appreciation um, to know whoever this person is in the universe. But you want to send a large donation to them. Um, for some, it could be, it, I mean, whoever it is, whoever it is in your life, you have to plug it in how it resonates. Um, for some, I feel it could be this Leo film, possibly, but it doesn't have to be. It really could be anybody. Um, whoever, however it resonates for you, Taurus Masculine, that's not a police officer. That's what I'm saying. Only you know your story, not anybody else. Um, but I heard basically um, you, um, you want to send a large donation because to send your gratitude and thanks. Um, contemplated it in the past and was going to, but was manipulated not to. And they understand why now. Understood it in the past. Well, damn. Okay, so you plug it in, how it resonates. Okay, so you understood why in the past. Um, okay, so you were going to send this huge, large ass donation to somebody in the past. Now, it could have been a reader or somebody else, whoever you are, towards masculine. But you understood why in the past why somebody basically manipulated you not to send the large donation but yet you went along with it you have to plug that in your life however it resonates um just saying now i'm not saying everybody's perfect not by any stretch maybe um i feel you probably feel you made a mistake um is what i'm feeling now now of course you know you can't undo the past you can't unravel the past you can't change the past i'm not judging anybody that's not my place here at all at all um, but however that resonates, it sounds like now you want to fix it. Now you want to fix it for us, masculine. That's not a police officer, whoever you are. Um, and kudos to you. Kudos to you. Um, so you may, I'm assuming you may send this large donation to whoever this person is, reader or not, or what have you. You may or may not. Of course, that's your own free will, your own prerogative. You may, you may not, but I heard you're contemplating it. Um, and you were going to do it in the past, but you were heavily manipulated not to, but now... And you knew you were. You knew you were heavily manipulated. Um, but now you're reconsidering. You're reconsidering, basically. So you plug it in, how it resonates. Um, number two or 34 could be very significant in one's life. Two or 34, beginnings and extremes. Huge 555 change energy coming for many people. Huge. Quickly. About to turn the tables on the past in a huge way. Okay, so you plug it in how it resonates. Heard huge 555 change energy coming for many people. About to turn, turn the tables on the past in a huge way. So, new beginnings, 555 change, um, turning the tables, turning the tides, energy. I'm feeling for a lot of you guys, it's people that you um, trusted in the past. Now you, now you know you can't trust. Um, cycles have completed. New cycles are starting. It's kind of like drawing the land, oh, the land, the um, line in the sand and figuring out who your enemies are and who your real allies are in my opinion the loyal ones versus the disloyal ones um the real versus the fake so five 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 new beginnings sounds like a lot of you guys are about to do it and you're about to do it quickly um because it sounds like you're about, either just had a huge awakening or wake up call or you're about to it's going to create a new beginning for you and the people that you're either loyal or disloyal to because it sounds like you're about to cut 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 off keep 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 what you need to keep um like protecting your energy protecting your space protecting your time protecting your money protecting yourself etc is what i'm feeling um it's to me it's like identifying who you need to be in your life and who you don't and for anybody who doesn't know my personal story i have spent like two years cutting people out of my life 
And that's the truth. But it's been the best thing ever happened to me. I mean, I can only speak for myself. But it sounds like some of you guys are about to do that. But it's about to create beginnings for you. Endings, which create new transformation and beginning. Um, for a lot of you guys. That's exactly what I'm feeling. Um, that's not what I'm feeling. But it sounds like your intuition is getting stronger and you're about to do it. Now, we have three people in here. Now, you don't have to be these three people. Just to let you guys know. You don't have to be these three people. You can be anybody. You can be people connected to these people. These are just the three people I'm pulling in here right now. So you plug in and how it resonates. Extremes. There's about to be a huge, 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 huge investigation on dark arts use in a community. Very populated community. Huge investigation. And there will be lots of evidence coming forward with text messages and messages and spells. etc. It's going to be huge. Oh my God. Whoa. So you plug it in how it resonates. My God. Wow. Okay. So I heard there's about to be um, a huge investigation coming up. Okay. It sounds like, okay, here's what I, I think. Yeah, skirt. It sounds like there's about to be a huge investigation to a black magic coven. And I didn't hear Black Magic Coven. I didn't. But that's from what it sounds like with the message. Dark arts investigation. Spells um, sent through text message. It could have been that dark arts, Libra or dark arts. Uh, not Libra. I'm sorry. I don't know why I said Libra. Dark arts, air sign femme or dark arts, water sign femme that had been um, basically manipulating their community. I was pulling in with Black Magic Coven in the summer of 20 um 2021 so it could be the same one possibly but that one was starting to get disbanded um in 20 or 20 uh 2020 but then there was some kind of reversal too so it could have been that same coven because it was starting to get exposed in the summer of 2020 for that coven but then the dark art spiritualist them that headed that coven she created um a spell reversal so um, I feel it's that same one I was pulling in. It might be a different one. But um, there was a huge spell reversal, though. Done. I think she watches my readings is exactly what I think. Um, so what I'm saying is there was a process of it being revealed, that COVID being revealed in the summer of 2020. But then that spell reversal was done. So I think it reversed it back. And now, all of a sudden, it's, it's finally ended. Cycles finally completed and ended, and now people are tired of this shit in their community, and they want this shit exposed. This is exactly what I feel. I mean, the head of that coven, that Arisan Vim, she's not dumb. She's not freaking dumb. So I'm sure it probably was the same coven, probably. I can't say it was or wasn't, because I'm not the Arisan Vim dark art spiritualist. But um, that's what I'm feeling from the messages I pulled in, is what I'm trying to say. So however that resonates, for whoever, um, but it sounds like there's about to be huge, I heard huge investigation regarding um, spells and um, I think that they sent you text and messages and spells and blood of something, something, something and sacrificing a finger or sacrificing, going and plucking the hair of somebody and skin particles or whatever the hell y'all do or did do for whatever dark arts, whatever, whatever. Um, but it sounds like people really, really want it um, exposed. And that's a freaking loop. Because let me tell you, you don't start exposing this shit. It's just going to get worse. I.e. that damn, because I was in the process of uncovering that damn black magic coven in the summer of 2020 on here. And all of a sudden, damn, that freaking reversal spell got cast out in the universe. And we're in freaking January 2nd of 2022. And I think now it's finally getting revealed again. Finally. When it was supposed to be revealed in freaking summer of 2021. And we're in freaking 2022 is what I'm trying to tell you. Confusion spells are real. Reversal spells are real. Um, that crap is real. Now, do I dabble in that shit? No. No. Hell no, I don't. But do I know it's real? Yes. If that makes sense. So, you plug it in 
how it resonates, if that resonates for you. But I heard it's about to be a huge investigation. Maybe this Taurus masculine is about to head this investigation or has very important um, information on these people that maybe was part of this coping that's going to help break it up, possibly. And this Taurus masculine, either he faked his death or somebody else faked his death or tried to kill him. I heard he thought a Leo Femme tried to kill him in the past, but now he knows who really tried to kill him. And it was one of her family members or members. Um, he might be very integral in police. Um, well, he is integral because I heard he was going to police too for protection. Um, so I think he might be integral in this too. I think this all kind of coincides is what I'm trying to say. And absolutely, freaking lootly yeah, absolutely. So um, new beginnings come for you guys. I think you're about to expose these. Uh, I think it's a water sign femme and an air sign femme. Um, cause I was pulling those in on, I think December, um, on Christmas. I'm sorry. I pulled those two readings in on Christmas. Um, you can go back and check them if you want to. Um, so you're about to make good discerning decisions in your own life, create new beginnings for you. And I think for some, the new beginnings is divulging this information to the police, this dark arts spells, these dark arts conversations, these um maybe it's plans to kill somebody for a sacrifice maybe it's plans to go hurt and harm an animal for a sacrifice maybe it's the actual spells that you bought from somebody to go for a sacrifice or not a sacrifice just to harm somebody however that resonates but i heard it's gonna be a huge investigation so i feel if enough of you guys get this information going and get it to the police it's about to create huge negative tower moments for these ass whites over here. I feel we're, that we're in the COVID. And I'm just, I think these are ahead of the COVID. Just for real, for real, for real. And if we're talking Secret Seven, those people, the core members of Secret Seven, slash the wolf pack, slash the wolf pup, slash the blah, blah, well, little wolf puppy CB neuter energy. All those people were members of the freaking COVID. Just saying, just saying. Because it all really coincided. It really did. If you go back and really listen to the readings, it really did. Sorry, I gotta be quiet. I gotta be quiet. I'm sorry. Um, it did. It coincided, you guys. It coincided. It did. Um, but everybody has their own intuition, logic, and reasoning. Just saying. Okay, so extremes. You realize it was extreme in the past. You're about to create new beginnings for yourself. I think you're about to divulge information to the police and the police is about to divulge information to high police. Um, I think on these people and the Taurus masculine, divulging information to the police, Leo Fibs being protected by the police. Um, so you plug it in how it resonates. A lot of police energy in here, a lot of Taurus masculine energy, a lot of, uh, and a Leo Fibs. And a Black Magic Coven, I think is that's about to be disbanded or exposed or something. And there's going to be some kind of text messages um, um, emails or pictures or it could be videos of sacrificial energy like a ceremony or something of that nature um, only you know your story not anybody else so if you're outside of these three people and you know about this black magic coven or this information on this huge coven that's about to be disbanded or um, because of an investigation internally in the police it sounds like that's going to disband them which I think is great because let me tell you, um, just skirt, skirt back for a minute. I've never seen on the news, and maybe y'all can tell me if you have through email or text because you know I have the comments off publicly. So you can text me or email me. But I've never seen public, and I don't watch news. I don't watch TV. I get my news through Facebook stream um, and news break, just saying for real. So I don't watch TV. But, um, I've never seen publicly is what I'm trying to say new uh, local or um, uh, local or national news um, a black magic coven arrest like a coven arrest I've seen gang arrest I've seen uh, you know we've all seen gang arrest we've seen things of that nature but not a black magic coven I think that would be the first I've ever seen in my life. And I think that's amazing um, because that shit, it really is real. It is real. It's just people don't want to believe it's real, but it really does harm people. It does. 
So kudos to the people about to go the damn police. Kudos to the police about to tell the police. And kudos to the Taurus masculine that, um, that had his life threatened in the past, thought it was somebody and it really was a fa another family member, going to the police. Kudos to you. Um, freaking kudos to you, whoever you are. All right, we're done. I'm going to quit gabbing my mouth. Love you guys. Namaste.